Hey sports fans, I thought I would make this video real quick. I know I'm not the first one to do this, but I haven't seen a write-up on it uh, on the forums or on the Facebook page. Last night the trunk would not open and uh, it was not the secondary lock because uh, Robert McCubbin actually removed that one for me a couple of weeks ago when we were at the crossfires in Carmel. Couldn't get the trunk open, but finally uh, putting a screwdriver in through the the license plate light here on the passenger side, I was finally able to get it enough to where I could I could pop it open. Turns out it's the rotating mechanism in the latch behind here. Uh, it's the plastic part that rotates 90 degrees. It had broken. So anyway, um, I've ordered another latch on eBay, but while that's coming, I needed something to be able to get in and out of the trunk. So what I did was I removed the little emergency uh the cable from the little emergency latch here you can see that and the lever that that attaches to i just attached i went down the hardware store and i bought a chain with a little clip end like this kind of like a little carabiner and then i ran it up and i ran it the chain through the grommet here and put the keychain end on it and uh, i just put electrical tape around this uh, so that it won't scratch the paint and it won't make a lot of noise, but it works great. I'll show you. We'll close it And then all you have to do is grab this pull it up and it unlocks um, And of course I need to keep my fingers on the grommet to keep it from coming out, but it works fine as a temporary solution um, I don't plan on having any, any bodies in here or any little kids, so I don't need the emergency latch uh, temporarily. So this will work. Gives me a way to get in and out of the trunk. So if anybody has this same problem, uh, this is a pretty easy solution to take care of that. So thank you.